Hello everybody, welcome back to the craft room. Um, Pad Sunday. Right. I bought this from Chloe's. Um, it's Chloe's card, cards and things. I think that's what she's called on a you on a web page. Um, if you pre-ordered it, you had this, but you also had a free stamp if you pre-ordered, and you had this free stamp set. And oh my god, it's stunning. It is pretty. Anyway, so, when I was looking through, you have the magazine in there. Plus, you have the stamp set, which is really nice, really pretty. I'll show you, get it out and show you. You had the stamp set it with it, with the magazine. So there's the stamp set. Let me put on, on there, you can see. So you had the shoe, the, la the little lady with the flowery dress and all that like. Plus you had the dies, the flower die. Plus you had the stencil. So there's the stencil. Okay. And then you have an embossing folder with it with it. Which is like that. So you have that. So when I was looking through the magazine, so it's not that one James, the plastic bag. Like I'll get this back in there in a minute, so I don't lose any of it. And let me fold that sticky down. So you have them. I was looking through the magazine, and there's some lovely things in there. What different people have made, plus what Chloe makes on her YouTube as well, plus what she in. Gives you ideas in there. Don't stick there. Take that tape off of there now. I'll pop that back in there. Plus, she gives you some, I, you know, ideas in the book. Plus, there's quite a few pages of papers and toppers in there. That is full of papers and toppers in there. There's quite a few. And anyway, when I was looking through there, as you can see, there's, there's one there that's pretty. What they used for the lady of the st in the stamp. That girl in the stamp and the flowers. But there was one in here. Yeah? That I took the inspiration from for this card. I'm not copying the card as copying it. I just took the inspiration for the card. So this was my take. So I've got a card here. This was a, a pre-bought card. These were from the works. Um and it is five by seven. Yeah, five by seven card. Okay, and then I've cut out this mirror card. It's gonna go on the top of there. And I've cut that just a shy, just leaving a little gap. And I cut out one of the papers, and it's this one. And I'm going to stick that onto the mirror card first. Like so. Let me get, just get this glue running. And I can see the hole. And I see the hole. And I know she closed her site down for a bit because her... Uh, 
when her father is not well and uh, I don't know if she's open again now I'm not sure I know she said that she emailed me and she said that she was closing the site for a little while but I don't know if she's reopened now I'm not sure But I love the stamps. I she sells some beautiful stamps. And this just got a little bit of a the border of that. I'm not straight for you. Now it is. And there's too much on the end today, so I'm gonna just Cut off a little bit off the end of there. A little bit longer on that end. Okay. So I got that piece. Then I got another piece. That's going to lay it on the top of there. But it's got a big, bigger border. And then with this other piece of paper. Got that on that side. And then they're on this side. Is a paler pink with white dots and I'm just going to use that one to go on top of there hope everybody's okay it's a miserable day you miserable raining pouring down I think we've been spoiled and then I'm gonna pop this on to the middle of this card In. Need enough to the centre as I can get it. I mean, you could use any papers or anything you want to use. Then I got a smaller piece again that's going to go onto there. Move that out the way. And I'm going to use where I used that one on that one. I've turned it over to use this one on the top. I think they used the impossible um, folder for this one when they done theirs, but I'm not sure. I think so. It's got a little bit of a border, like so. And I'm gonna turn this paper back in. that in to the centre of that one like so and then I'm going to just put that on this card now I did put an insert in the middle of this card I'm new 
I'm just giving you the ideas. I mean, you could use any ca card or any colours that you wish. And just run with it what you want to do. I just got that then onto my card base. Just run the I couldn't stamp out happy birthday on a piece of white paper stamped happy birthday and then I backed it on with that mirror card and I don't know where I'm going to put it you know I, I used the die in there and I die cut the three flowers I've layered them up and put a little gem in the centre and I done it five times I think six times I've done it but I might use I don't know how many I'm going to use I might just use three put three there and I put, um, stamped out the flower leaves and I fussy cut them so I'm going to some leaves in there and I probably stink a weller <laughs> I stink a well them and I'm just gonna pop some of these in there in there I think they used used them and come down there with them but I don't want too many of them on there I I think it was overpowering him. Less is more in my opinion. So I think I'm going to do that. I don't like too many. To be honest. Does it look? They look too many on there. I think three is enough. I'm thinking, let me, I'm going to glue the leaves on, I'm going to put the flowers on first and then I can see where the leaves are going to go, I can always tuck the leaves in, so I put one on there, I think you put too much on it and it takes the card away, in my opinion, but uh, lift up. And this one has two little leaves on. You hear that rain? Good gosh. Um, squithers. Okay. 
happy. And then I'm going to put some foam pads on this piece. I think that's, that's fine. I don't know, let's have a look. Mm. I don't know. Do I, do I or no? Do I, do I or no? Tell me. I want them on there now, like it. Oh, I don't know, decisions. I like that. But I like that as well. Oh, I don't know. I like that. I'm going to do it. Do it, Jane. Just do it. Just do it. <laughs> I'm going to just do it. Why not? I need the leaf now by there. I knew you all shouting at me. <laughs> do it. Do it. <laughs> do it. <laughs> Don't do it. Do it. Do it. Tell me in the comments, would you have done that or would you have left it? <laughs> I like it. I like it. I like that now, to be honest. It do look nice. Do like it. That is pretty. There you go. There you go. That is pretty. And it is a lining in there. Just write this sentiment. That is pretty actually. I do like that. That is bright. So there you go, that's Cat Cindy. And that was easy enough to do. But as I said, if you, you know, you don't have to use those colours or those flowers. You could use anything you got. Use any flowers you got, any colours, any leaves you got. You know, I'm going to be them. But I hope I had a new proud. Cleo, uh, yeah, Cleo, Chloe, I hope I think you're proud with your, your, uh, stamps and your, your bits, I hope you like that, I hope you like it, uh, for Card Cindy, and give me a thumbs up, and if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe, and I'll speak to you all on the next video. So thanks for watching. Bye for now.